Implosion an instance of something collapsing violently inward. The U.S. Navy says it detected sounds, consistent with an implosion, shortly after the sub lost contact on Sunday during a descent to the Titanic wreck at 3,800 meters below sea level. But this information was only made public on Thursday. The loss of the deep water vessel was finally confirmed after a huge search mission in the area off Canada's Newfoundland province. Titan's hull is believed to have collapsed on Sunday as a result of enormous water pressure. The sub was built to withstand such pressure and experts will now be trying to determine what exactly went wrong. Analysis of the debris may help to establish this. Titan is believed to have been 3,500 meters below sea level when contact was lost. The vessel was so deep that the amount of water on it would have been equivalent to the weight of the Eiffel Tower, tens of thousands of tons. If there were a rupture to the structure, the pressure outside would be much greater than the one inside the hull, compressing the vessel. Look at the sample of implosion outside the water. Let us try to estimate the energy released from the implosion of the Titan submersible in terms of TNT. The answer is approximately 1,940 sticks of dynamite. Now, let us work backwards. Number 1, the details provided are not enough for an exact calculation, but we can make some reasonable assumptions and approximations to get a ballpark figure. Number 2, we will also need to recall a few physics principles. The depth of the Titanic rests about 13,000 feet deep in the North Atlantic Ocean. The pressure underwater increases by about 1 atmosphere for every 10 meters of depth. So, at 4,000 meters, the pressure is about 400 times atmospheric pressure, or 40.53 megapascals. The vessel, the Titan, submersible was a complex combination of carbon fiber and titanium. Its exact volume is not given but a reasonable estimate for a vessel that can carry five people might be 10 cubic meters. Number 3, the energy released when a submersible implodes is due to the work done by the pressure of the water rushing in to fill the volume the submersible previously occupied. We can estimate this using the formula for work done, which is force times distance. The force is the pressure times the area, and the distance is the radius of the submersible. However, this is a complex calculation as the force is not constant, it changes as the submersible collapses. A rough estimation can be achieved using the formula for the potential energy of a compressed fluid. Number 4, the formula is energy is equals to pressure. Energy 40.53 times 10 to the power of 6 power times 10 to the power of 3 is equals to 405.3 times 10 to the power of 6 joules. We need to convert this to an equivalent amount of dynamite. One kilogram of TNT has about 4.184 times 10 to the power of 6 joules of energy. So, the equivalent mass of TNT is 97 kilogram of TNT. That is equivalent to approximately 1,940 sticks of dynamite, considering one stick of dynamite weighs approximately 0 0.05 kilograms. to see shark breeding ground. They say it's really cool. The crew closes the hatch from the outside. Number 5, the sound of such an implosion would be quite noticeable at the surface. Without specifics on the exact acoustics involved, we can consider that underwater explosions are generally audible for many miles. The original sound was detected by an acoustic listening system, demonstrating the reach of such an implosion. Keep in mind, this is a rough estimate based on a series of assumptions. You're in the water, people. Divers detach the sub from the platform, and away you go, in theory. <laughs> Hold integrity. Holding. And what happened next? You won't be disappointed. Feel free to watch the simulation of Oceangate Titan implosion. The submersible that transported the five victims to the inspiring site of Titanic was securely locked from the outside, utilizing a minimum of 17 bolts. 
Once inside, a 250,000 US dollars lockup, absolutely no means of escape from within for a very expensive price. This is a luxurious way to die. Rest in peace to the victims of this tragic incident. For more interesting videos please subscribe to Stay Beastly YouTube channel.